The witness. The malefactor of our first collapse is at our doorstep. Once thought to be a force known as the darkness, the witness revealed itself to be an entity that instead wields the darkness against us. It spoke through our ghosts and offered us salvation if we submitted to it. We refused. Though we do not know its true intentions, we can only assume it seeks to finish what it started during our collapse. Our resolve was tested when Sabathune, Hive Goddess of Trickery, disguised herself as one of our foremost guardians, Osiris. She gained access to our secrets, but in turn, Osiris gained access to hers. Sabathune had rebelled against the Witness, and hid what might be our only chance of defeating it away on the planet Neptune. Now, former Cabal Emperor Callus and his loyalist warships have joined the Witness's advance on Earth. But we found an unexpected ally in Callus' daughter, Empress Keitel, and Mithrax, the Elixni leader of the House of Light. Together, we have united against our common enemy. In an unprecedented move, the Traveler left Earth to confront the Witness head-on. This conflict was set in motion long before we existed, but we will bring it to an end, one way or another. Vanguard to all units. Keep the enemy away from the Traveler. At all cost.
They found a veil. We're in no position to engage the enemy. We don't have a choice. We're out of time. Osiris. Too late. They've got the veil. Guardian, I don't... This doesn't feel right. The veil? It's worse than before. Much worse. Ah! much stronger this time. I feel sick. Like I shouldn't be here. We're in this together. Osiris and Nimbus need to hear about this. Something far more dangerous. A hungry, desperate beast. Once the Cabal Empire and all its bounty was his to command and his to consume. Joy was his purpose and his strength, he said. To angst over edicts and enemies was weakness. But 
I could see in his eyes. Dread that his pleasures would soon come to an end, clouding his sight from an incoming coup. I should have killed him then, but I thought exile more fitting. I thought he'd shriveled to nothing in the void of space. Instead, he caught a glimpse of something more. The chance to become greater than he'd ever been. Like a war beast after a blood scent, he chased that chance, abandoning all honor, reason. There was nothing he would not sacrifice for his own salvation. And when the witness came to him at last, Callus faced what he had run from all along. If we don't stop him, he'll make sure it's the end for us all. Let's 